Hey there, this is Matteo from Spano Milano and today we're in Via Orti, very close to Porta Ramana. You know, to show you a shared apartment with five bedrooms, two bathrooms, a shared kitchen and several balconies, which is located on the third floor, is accessible but through the stairs and through this elevator that you can see right over here. So now, let's just go ahead and let me show you around. So the entrance to our apartment is just uh, right over here on the left. As we walk in, we access the entrance hall, which gives way to the rest of the apartment. On the right hand side, we find uh, bedroom number one, which is which has a shared uh, balcony with uh, bedroom number two, which is right here on the side. Here we have the first of the two bathrooms, the shared kitchen. While proceeding through the other hallway, we find uh, bedroom number three, bedroom number four and uh, five, as well as the second uh, shared bathroom. So we're just gonna begin our tour with the shared spaces, which include this uh, large hallway with a huge uh, cupboard in here where you can store the cleaning uh, products and tools. Here we have uh, several uh, shelving, so there's uh, plenty of uh, space to store any sort of stuff. While in this uh, luminous uh, entrance hall, we find uh, yet another cupboard here at the bottom with some shelvings inside, a large uh, mirror. And uh, through this uh, foldable door, we access a smaller corridor, which gives way to the kitchen, first of all, here on the left. It is uh, modern and fully equipped. We find, uh, first of all, a large uh, fridge in this corner, pretty spacious inside, with a freezer at the bottom, with three compartments. Going past it, here we've got a large washing machine. On the top, we have a cupboard, with some shelvings where you can store the cups and glasses. On the kitchen counter, we also have this uh, huge uh, double sink with a large uh, drawer at the bottom, room for the rubbish built in. And here, continuing, we've got the induction stove, a large drawer which includes uh, all the cutlery provided with the apartment, and uh, several large uh, drawers as well. Here on the top we have uh, some more cupboards and uh, storage compartments. And there's also a lot of natural light which is coming in through these uh, large French windows which are overlooking the interior courtyard and this nice tree. In this other corner we find a microwave as well as the oven at the bottom. On this side we've got some more semi-transparent uh, cupboards. Another one in here with some more pots and one here at the top which is mostly technical. Here just past it we've got a table with uh, five uh, seats so you can accommodate all of the tenants. On top of it we've got a modern flat screen TV. There's also a handy clock over there. Well here we have the first of the two shared bathrooms in which we find a washing machine as well. We got both of the toilets in this case, both bathroom and bidet. A small sink with its uh, mirror on the top, a couple of shelvings on the side. And here we've got a modern and luxurious uh, bathtub with a shower as well. That's its hose. We've got a glass uh, wall here and a little window. So we're now just going to begin the tour of the shared bedrooms. Starting with uh, bedroom number one. So each of them have their separate keys so they can be locked. And here we find a full-length uh, mirror. There's a chest of drawers here, which is uh, fairly spacious, as well as a standalone wardrobe with uh, sliding doors, very tall and deep, so super spacious. Plus the second uh, extra door right over here. The bed is a comfortable double one right in that corner. And here we find a little uh, desk with its chair and a set of uh, shelvings on the top plus uh, the lamp. This bedroom comes with uh, French doors which are leading to the uh, first uh, balcony shared with uh, bedroom number two. So it's also accessible through those French doors. We're overlooking this uh, super quiet and nice uh, interior courtyard with these uh, safety fences which can actually be opened. I can actually smell the pizza which is uh, being made uh, nearby here as we are super close to our very popular and good uh, pizza place, Da Michele Condurro, so you might want to check it out. Regarding the location, as we mentioned, we're super close to Porta Romana. The nearest underground stops are either Corvetto or uh, Porta Romana, both belonging to line number three, the yellow one, and they're just uh, two or three stops away from uh, Duomo. 
So a very quick connection. Here we have uh, bed number two, which has this uh, side entrance. We find again a nice uh, double bed with its uh, bedside table, at the bottom of which we find a larger desk with its uh, chair and shelvings, white and yellow, very colorful. And on the opposite side, we've got a standalone wardrobe with a built in uh, mirror on that one, and uh, plenty of space in here, again, very tall and deep. This is, as you mentioned, the access to the shared balcony with uh, bedroom number one, still an interior one. And we can now go through the entrance hall in order to show you the other side of the apartment. There, as you can notice, we've got the router for the Wi Fi. And here we can show you bedroom number three. Again, we find a chest of drawers here just behind the entrance door. Colorful painting there on the wall. And a very similar standalone wardrobe. With a double door on this side and a single one with a built in uh, mirror. The bed is again a double one with its uh, wooden bedside table and a couple of shelvings on the top. While in that corner you've got the studio station with uh, three shelvings, the lamp and the desk. In this case the window is overlooking the same courtyard as the kitchen, so nice and quiet. And here we are now proceeding through the hallway. Here we have some uh, room for the shoes. In uh, bed number four, which is uh, larger than the previous ones, we find a large uh, double bed in the middle. In that corner, we have a super tall uh, standalone uh, wardrobe with uh, double doors, some shelvings in this one, and uh, a cupboard here with some uh, racks to hang your clothing. It's very tall. A Beatles uh, poster on the side of a full length uh, mirror. A long shelving here, which is uh, leading to the studio desk. In this case, a nice uh, matte black with three shelvings on the top. In that other corner, we've got the chest of drawers as well as the bedside table. Another shelving there, and there's also a safe built in. These uh, luminous windows, in this case, are overlooking the street side where we came from, so that's the access to our building. Porta Romana is towards the right hand side. It is a very happening district. We have uh, several bars where you can hang out at night time, or also several facilities, including shops and supermarkets, which are just a uh, walking distance, as this is a very well serviced area. We are now looking at bedroom number five, with its bedside table, the double bed, a series uh, of uh, shelving here, which you can use as a library as well as its uh, desk in uh, white tones in this case with the three shelvings and on the opposite side a tall standalone uh, large wardrobe it's pretty much the double as the previous one very well organized on the inside with some uh, organizers there very tall a mirror built in and there's even a second door in this case with uh, shelvings and a uh, rack on the top to hang your clothing this is the only bedroom which comes with its own private balcony, accessible through these uh, French doors. In this case it is uh, an exterior one. We have this uh, movable uh, shelter. And uh, again we are overlooking the street side. It's a nice surrounding, as we mentioned. We're still just a walking distance from the city center. You can just reach Duomo in pretty much a 10, 15 minute walk, depending on your speed. And now as a last step, we can show you the second of the shared bathrooms, in which we've got this uh, very large uh, box shower. Both of the toilets again, the bathroom within, a set of uh, shelving here for your hygiene products, and a small sink with its uh, mirror on the top. A tall window here, which is just facing the balcony where we came from. So a very spacious and uh, well-organized apartment. Plenty of uh, space but for all of the tenants. Just bear in mind a single kitchen, shared between uh, the five bedrooms. But overall, uh, very nicely located, close to the city center and to several of the main universities of, of Milan, the Bocconi, Cattolica, and so on. And with this, we show you everything. So thanks for watching, and see you next time.
Tchau, tchau.